Y'all, we got a lot of exciting stuff going on today. Look who we have on our boat today. Hero. Yes. <laughs> We're going for salmon. Salmon? Yes. Oh, wow. You, nice. you never, I never catch a salmon before. Never caught a salmon? Oh. Okay. I want you to do everything okay i'll be the captain okay so when we're out to the salmon grounds there'll be two rods okay. as soon as the rod goes off okay. and starts pumping go to the rod and start reeling it okay. don't even take it out of the holder just start just reeling it, it. yeah okay. until we have tension okay. once you have tension take it out and then just fight it and i'll work the boat and once you get it towards the boat i'll net it so, i was thinking maybe i could prepare a one day smoked salmon for you to try okay and you can try it and let me know what you think, maybe how I could improve it, if All anything. Right. And yeah, I think it'll be a fun oh, day. Right. Let's, go. Let's do it. I've been waiting months and months for these to come in. These are my own cable baiters, the Fisherman's Life cable baiters. And the reason why I'm so excited to sell these is because there's other brands and you get maybe two of them for like eight bucks. But I'm selling these for five with the nails for $5.99. No way. Shows you exactly how to rig it, how to use it if you never used them before. If you're like a store and you want to sell them and buy them wholesale, just send me an email and we'll work something out. But otherwise, $5.99 for everybody. They work the best. That's awesome. All right, let's get out of here. Before we get out there, I've seen a couple people do this before and I wanted to try. A lot of times when you have these anchovies sitting out for a while, they get really soft and they start to fall apart and you can't fish them for that long. So what I've seen a couple people do is they kind of brine it but they don't put it in a in a in a liquid brine. I don't know. Never never done this before, but I'm going to try it today. Got a package of salt. I'm going to put a bunch of salt on the anchovies in the tray. Just put a bunch of salt here in the tray first. Lay those on it and then put some more on the top. That'll take out some excess moisture. And maybe we can eat it after too, maybe. <laughs> Just in case we can't catch something. Sashimi. <laughs> Such, anchovy yeah. stuff. All right, we're going to keep these in the, free, in the cooler and let them get a little bit of moisture out and stay tough. So once we get out there, they should be thawed a little bit and tougher. So. I mean, there's a lot of boats coming out here right now. There's one, there's three in front of us. There's four more behind us. There's a couple to our side. So people know where the bite is. The word got out last night. All right, there's probably about a hundred boats out here. We got to a spot where we saw some birds diving. So we're gonna you know, just start fishing here and we're gonna, I think we're close enough to other boats where we can see their nets and if their nets start going in then we know that they're catching at least but yeah there's pelicans out here there's fish on the fish finder so i'm going to get a cable baiter rigged up and start trolling two miles an hour three miles an hour now is the real test going to take one of these out they all these come with um nails and rubber bands instructions are on the package but you basically want to get it like that Nail through the head, through the hole in the cable baiter. Wrap that rubber band around. Okay, slight bend. Yep. All right, Hero, this is a sinker release. If you ever used one of these, it's okay. a copper thing. This is the leader, you pull this down and this, it's like a spring action. You can see that it goes up and down like that in, inside there. Okay. So you put that in, oh. in there like that, okay. Actually there's two of them. One is a little bit longer and the longer one, it's gonna take a bigger fish to pull it out. So when a fish bites, this is gonna pull, the sinker will drop and then you'll just f fight the fish, just the line, all right? So. We are gonna start trolling. We're gonna go 30 feet. We're at 39 feet deep, so we're gonna go 30 feet. So we're gonna do 
30 one foot pulls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, 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 twenty,
when she was taking the shower, her other patch got stuck to her back. So she had a patch on her back and a patch on her ear. She had a double dose. Oh, man. That's just some story I read on. Okay. <laughs> Right, yeah. You know, I'm having that event in July, uh -huh. and we have a whole block, so we have different... Oh, fish, 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 real, 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 real. Oh, got it? Real, 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 real to it. Just real. Is fish on still? You feel it? I think it's just... Yep. Yep, you got fish on. You got fish on? Yeah. Oh yeah! Oh, oh it's yeah. a bird! It's a Fish bird! Hunt. Hooked a bird! A bird! Wow! Oh no, we don't want no bird! Oh no! Oh. Wow! Oh. Okay, don't reel anymore. Step back! Step back! Well then, that's not what we wanted, but that bait looks good though. Hey, little guy! All right, all right. Let's see. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Right, stop! 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 All right. All right, hold on, hold on, yeah. All right, man, I got him. You lucky, you lucky it's a barbless hook, all right? All right, let him go. Yeah, let him go. All right. Here, I'm picking a duck. Bring it back to Martin Yan for picking duck. All right, I'm going to do a quick Instagram story. <laughs> Chef Hero, first, first catch. First catch. Ah, uh, fish on. Actually not. All right. Picking duck, picking duck. Oh, no. Man, well, little update, kind of slow. We heard of a fish here and there, but I mean, there are a lot of boats around us. I mean, all around yeah, us. It's nice, it's nice out here, but you know, no fish yet. We're still trying. We're going to get some 842. I'm about to check the baits, make sure they're fishing right. I got two ready to go, bent already. One thing if you do buy these, Stretch out the rubber bands first. It makes the gills easier to wrap around if the rubber bands are stretched out a little bit, but that's about the bend you want. I like the bend right there in the front, kind of like that. Gives it a really nice fast spin. Look at all this bait. And see how it breaks off into another little bait ball. I don't know, I, I don't love to see that when the bait is like separated. It seems like sometimes that's when the big fish are separating the bait and feeding it and forcing it into a ball. Hopefully that's what's happening. So what's your favorite fish? Fish? Uh, uh, red the red one. Yeah. And also the white fish. White fish? Yeah, like a ranta or snapper. Sea bass? Sea bass, yeah, sea bass. Halibut? You like set yeah, halibut? Halibut too. Yeah, lion fish. Oh, lionfish is good eating. Uh, white fish, I like Oh, it. Yeah. yeah. They've got that in Florida, yeah. right? A lot of... Yeah, hey, uh, Osprey with the center console. Osprey. Yeah. One thing I want to start doing more is bringing my catch to restaurants and having oh, okay. them professionally oh, yeah, prepared. Nice. really nice. Yeah, so if you know any restaurants or... You know, oh, you got something here. Yeah? I didn't see that, was it? No. Something shook. Oh, yeah, yeah, fish on, fish on, fish on. Real, 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 real. Nice. All right, hero has got something. Oh, we got my have one over here too. Let's see what that is. Just a bit. Oh yeah. If it if it runs, just let it run. It's cool. Oh. All right, nice. Finally, nice, fish nice, on, y'all. Finally, finally. Let's see what we got. Nice. Hero's in good shape. And and you know, oh wait 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 a second. Hold on. We keep him out there. Keep him out there. Oh yeah, keep him out there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we gotta get this rod away. Okay. okay. Salmon too. I don't want him to get tangled up, so I gotta bring this down. Okay, if he runs, just bring it in. Uh, just let him run, I mean. Okay. Alright. Bait in. Alright. Okay. How are you doing? Good, good, good.
Okay, hero. You go behind me. Keep keep pinching on him. Yeah, re real one? You lost him? No? no, 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 no. Okay. Real, 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 real. Oh, jumping. Okay, hold on. Okay. Here we go. Oh wait. Okay, lift them, lift them up. Hold on, hold on. Keep them away from the boat. Oh. Okay. Lift up, lift up. Send that. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Yes. Oh yeah. Nice. Nice. Oh yes. All right, that's the king. King Sam, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Beautiful. All right, let's get that bonker behind you. There's a. Yep, that black. If you want to bonk him, hero? Just hit him in the head. We know he's got black gums. That's not a silver. Yep. Nice. One more time. Nice. Cool. Hell yeah, man. Beautiful job, oh, yeah. son. Finally. <laughs> Your first king size, size, size is okay. Oh yeah, they need to be. Uh... Yep, black gums. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. 20, 20 inches. This one is. This one's at least. Let's see. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, 23. You know. Not, not the biggest, but all right. First one, okay. all right. Awesome. Damn, I was gonna bring my bucket to bleed these fish, but I don't have my bucket. But we know his heart is still beating, even though we bonked him. Heart beats for several minutes after he dies. Gonna bleed him, put him in the net, and at least get some blood out that way. So, right there on the gills, I'll start bleeding out. Just put him in the net. Let him bleed out in here. Actually, Hero, can you hold this? Just make, hold it up, up and down. Got it? Bleed him in there, gills in there. Oh, yes. oh it feels good. It feels good, <laughs> Gillen. Oh, fish. Oh, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. That was a fish. That was, yeah, fish on. Real, 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 real. Real, real, real. Yep, yep. Okay. Oh, fish on, fish on, fish on. Doubled up. This is crazy. We have double, double fish on. Look at this. Mads and Hero at the same time. This is crazy. Yep. Okay, okay. I'm going to need to control this and get the net ready. Do you want to net it or do you want to no, no, film? I, I want to film. <laughs> Good one? Did he come off? Where is he? You wanted a big one here, this is it. Oh yeah. Here, um, hold on, hold on. Let's keep him down. Try to keep him that way, keep him that way. Alright y'all. Just doubled up. Okay, reel, go a step back, reel in, reel a little bit more. Step back a little bit, step back a little bit. Okay, good. Yep. Now, now reel down to it, reel down to it. Put your rod down and reel to it. Okay, now lift, now, yeah, keep really, now lift up. Nope, not yet. Oh, nope. One more time. Oh, watch out that way, go that way, go that way. Got him. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Good job. All right, get that out of the net. Good job, good job. Nice yeah, job. we still got another one. I don't know, this one might be small. 
Yes, that is a king, and it's over 20 inches. You know, a couple small ones, but hey. I don't even know if this one dropped the ball yet. This one might be small, but we still got him on here. No. All right. Oh, we had him on. Oh, we got him on there. Uh, could be. I don't want him to take the ball if possible. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. That's This one's decent. Okay. Oh, he just dropped the ball now. Oh, he's just kind of small. They might be a keeper. No. You want to hold this? Yeah. Okay, reel them in. Okay, rod out that way. Nice. All right. About the same size, right? Small, yeah. Smaller. It's king, though. All right, nice. All right, y'all. Let's measure them. I mean, 21, I mean, he's a little small, but got him, it's all right. And the other one, he's a keeper too. Let's get that bonker. All right, this one, you got him already? Yep. Cool. Nice, all right. Congratulations, guys. Wow. Amazing, two at a time. <laughs> yeah, same size about. About the same size, huh? Yeah, yeah, about the same size. Yep. Two kings. Oh, wow. Congratulations. Nice little guys, but I mean, they'll do. Hey, fish is a fish in my opinion. Yeah. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. Good. Good job. Oh, wow. All right, one thing to remember when you're fishing a cable baiter or a crippled anchovy, or really anything for that matter, is you don't necessarily always just want to go by the book and fish it two miles an hour or three miles an hour. Sometimes you'll be fishing it four miles an hour and you only want to go with what the action looks like of the bait in the water. If you can see this, that anchovy is spinning really fast. And that's what we want. Right now we're trolling 4.7 miles an hour. We might be going with the current. So with the current, you got to be trolling faster than the current to make that bait spin. We got 40 minutes to catch one more fish because Hero and Charles, they have to go and they've got another uh, collab they're doing since they're from Florida and they're visiting the West Coast. They got this strict deadline. So instead of doing the one day smoked salmon catch and cook, I'm gonna prepare it a little bit longer process the normal way. And then I'm gonna meet them up on Wednesday before they have to head out. Hero can try it and give me his chef's palate opinion. That's going down for sure. But now we just wanna catch one more fish. All right, two fish aren't gutted. All this cold, cold ice. Gonna gut them real quick, take the guts out. Of course, king salmon, black gums, green back. So gut it like this. Up to the gills, just open it up all the way. Now the best part on a smoked salmon normally is usually this belly. All that fat really smokes up well. It's a little bit thin here, but it's still gonna be good. So like before cutting right beneath the connective tissue there, cutting out the gills in the front, both sides here. Connective tissue underneath. And with a smaller salmon like this, you can almost just rip the guts out and hold the guts and that's where all the food goes, cut right beneath it. Are you sure those aren't parasites? Oh, 100% those are not parasites. I'm not okay. sure what they are, but all salmon tend to have them. Okay. Grab the gills, guts. Um, what else can we do? Is that the heart? I was trying to find the heart for Hero, but <laughs> can't find it. Must have fallen out. Oh, here it is. I'll come out. Moving? No, this one's this one's done. Okay. Yeah, right. You want the heart? It's very small. Huh? <laughs> no. Okay. All right, we'll toss it this time. All the guts here. Bloodline. If I don't have a spoon, I'll cut on one side of that bloodline. 
cut on the other side of that bloodline. And then I'll make sure I got a good fingernail file at home before I dig it out with my fingers. All right, that's one small king, but still a king. Nice. Well, Hero has his knife and looks like time's running out. So, looks like we're not gonna be able to get that limit today. Still got another minute, but looks like we're gonna have to pull the plug in a sec and head on back. Passing through some bait, so this is our final opportunity. So like we said earlier, a slight change of plans now. Hero is going to fillet. He's scaling one of the salmon. Okay, first I'm going to take off the head. Okay, head off. Then I'm going to start a fillet. I'm gonna show it this side. A little bit, guide line. You got to go deeper. And same way, this side. Must be a sharp knife. Most important thing. Mm -hmm. oh, beautiful. Okay, and take it out. Easy, look at that. Easy, easy. One fit it down. On this side, I just go for like that. Okay, so um, take the camera off. This is the bone. Here's also. Okay, basically that's it. So uh, they have another bone here. Yeah. Yeah. We're just gonna pick it up for the tweeter. Okay. Yeah, better. And uh, that you want to keep the belly on or keep the belly on? Belly on, on right? Yep. Okay. Yep. So pretty much uh, that's it. You All want right. to pick up this, take I'll, on this thing. I'll do that at home. You do. Okay. Yep. Okay. So that's it. Easy. All right. Sounds yeah, good. Very easy. Well, Hiro san now we're gonna be in your kitchen. Yes. At Isaac's place. Yeah. All right. Matt, we'll see you when the food is ready. Can't wait. Okay. All right. Sounds good. All right, y'all. Well, we done. We did it. Hero had to go. Charles had to go. We're going to meet him up on Wednesday, but yeah, it was a little bit worrisome at the beginning, but these cable baiters, they pulled through at the end once we found the fish. Nothing broke, and I didn't lose a single nail and rubber band. So five cable baiters, $5.99. If you want them in bulk, just email me. We'll get you mass pricing, bulk pricing. Um, yeah, I'm really excited just because these are cheaper than any other competitor on the market. The plan with all this Fisherman's Life tackle is to give you something affordable and that's catered to the type of fishing that we do here on the West Coast. So all along the West Coast, got these special jigs, rockfish bobbers, of course these cable baiters and many more things to come. So everything I'm going to try to keep it priced very affordable for all y'all. Salmon cable baiters, baby. The Wire Salmon Slayer 5-pack. All right, I'm going to go back home, smoke these salmon. Um, I did a video on that before, so if you want to see how I did it exactly, I'm going to do the exact same recipe. A third cup of salt, one cup of brown sugar, and just a water. Wet brine overnight, dry it, pat it dry, let, this, let the film uh, form on it, then smoke it at a low temperature for a couple hours. Meet up Hero and Charles in the morning on Wednesday, and they're cooking up something too. So this is going to be exciting for me to try also, that salmon marinade. Thank you for joining me on, so far. We'll see you in a little bit. Started the day at 4 a.m., 6 p.m. now. I have finally filleted, deboned, cleaned up, and brined these salmon. So this is the wet brine. Like I said, if you want to know how to do this, check out the recipe. But these are ready to go in the fridge overnight. Just enough time. To prep it for a hero and Charles. So a couple days later, uh, this is the smoked salmon I did. 
I haven't showered or, mm. or shaved for two <laughs> days. So if you smell fish, yeah. that's the fish you caught. Okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, this was smoked salmon, little um, salt, brown sugar, brine for a day, okay. and then honey glazed. Mm. So mm. we'll try that later. Sure. Okay, and, good. and this is the salmon we caught also? Yes, after filet, I marinate with the miso. So this miso has a sugar, a sake, and a mirin okay. together. Okay. So it's almost day and a half sitting into the miso. It's very right. thick. Yeah, very thick. Yeah. So I take off the miso out and I put it in the seed pan and then 350 degree oven, uh -huh. cook about 10 to 15 minutes. Okay. That's it, very simple. Simple, very I can tasty. do that. That sounds easy. Yeah. Okay, first step, I want to take miso out. So you don't want to rinse it? No, you don't need to rinse it. Just uh, taking out miso like this. Like that. That's it. So next step, I'm going to put a little bit oil on the seed pan. Side up, yeah, skin side up. I'm going to. Okay. Then I'll, I'll, later on, I'm gonna flip. Okay. Yes. Okay. To the oven. Okay. Now wait to 10 to 15 minutes. At 350 degrees. Yes, 350. Yes. All right. Here it's been about 10 minutes. When you when you check the oven, what are yes. what are you looking for to see when it's done? Actually, I'm looking for the um, and the skin color getting a little bit brown. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's going to be take another two, three minutes. Two, three minutes. Yes. All right. All right. Okay. After about 18 minutes, this fish is done. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. It is Beautiful brown color. a little bit. Right. So this is it. That looks good. Yeah. That looks great. Wow. Maybe try this one first. Sure. Let's, let's have this piece. Whatever you want to try first. Yeah, you okay. So yeah. I go. First, smoked salmon. Yeah, right there. Yep. Wow, I never had smoked salmon. Before. You know, it's funny. I had a dream last night that you both tried it. You tried it first. You said it was amazing. And then Hiro tried it and he said, like, on a scale of 1 to 100, it's about a 51. No. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Hiro, I'm make going a to. dream come true. Tell me it's. No, don't make a dream come true. I'm trying to. Yeah, go ahead. Hmm. Yeah. 100. Wow. In 100. 100. 10 out of 10. 10 wow. out of 10. Wow. Yes. Little, oh, this is good though. Mm. Mm. You know, mm. some people can sm smoke it a little bit longer. This is a little soft. Some people, if you smoke it longer, it gets a little bit more of the moisture out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But Tastes like you could buy commercially off the shelf. After this, I can't wait. Right? Eat the rice. Okay, go. So good. Some rice, you know? Enjoy. Mmm. But with the fatty, and this is a small one. And it's, it's kind of fatty too, you know? I like the texture in there. This one just mixed with the rice. Yeah. Like a salmon yeah. rice, I usually do, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's so good. Look at wow. The texture is amazing. Very oily. And tastes, like I said, it tastes like it was, you could buy it at a store. Mm. But even better mm. because it's not dried out at all. Sometimes in, when it's canned, it's really dry. Well, we got the chef's approval. Yeah. Mm. So, do you, do, you, do you eat the skin? Skin, yes, I do. I do. Maybe try a piece of the skin yeah. if you can break it off. I don't know if you can break that off. Oh, yeah, that's that's, that's, that's my favorite part. Good part. I love mm. skin on, on anything. Mm. Chicken, no yeah, scales. Salmon, right. A lot of flavor in it. A lot of flavor. Yeah. Right? Between skin and meat. Wow. This is perfect. Thank you. And here, so you guys good. caught this fish. That's the best Oh, yeah. Part. But this is a thin, you know, you know when the, mm. you have a 20 pound fish, mm. the belly is... Yeah, more thicker, right? Yeah, that's even better. But. Mm. All right, that makes me happy. Okay. Now, please eat. Yeah, yeah. What's the best way to, to, no, to eat? No, just take just the tail like that. Yeah. And eat. Mm. With the skin too. Yep. Yeah, 
skin too. Yeah, skin's the best part. Mm, yeah, mm. Oh, yeah. Good. Yeah. First time Matt's eating miso mm. salmon. Mm. Three out of ten. No. Yeah. A ten out of ten too. Oh, ten. Thank you very good. much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I don't have my palate. You, you've eaten so many different varieties mm, of food. Mm, you, you, know, you can draw from so much. I don't have too much to draw from, but mm, this mm. is so good. You know? Yeah, this miso marination you can use for the king mackerel, mm -hmm. also the black cod. Mm -hmm. It's also good too. Like black a fatty really fish. Popular, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think same with the smoked salmon, more of like a mackerel. Mm. Herring, maybe you could probably do this with herring. Herring, yeah, you can do that too. Yeah, yeah of course, of course. Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so, uh, mackerel. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. It's good, it's not too strong. I really like it, yeah. Mm. So you have it like right when you put it, right when you taste it, there's a flavor. What's that flavor? Is that the miso? That's yeah, miso flavor coming in fast, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And like mm -hmm. a little gli um, little caramelization. Well, car yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I added a meeting and a little bit of sugar. Mm. Mm, yeah. That's great. And the skin side, maybe you can do a little bit more cr crunchy yeah, yeah. side. Mm. For a little longer. Yeah, a little bit more you can cook longer too. So, yeah, it would be great if you can come back sure. next year. Or next year, or maybe might we're going to come back by October. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. we'll be back in October mm -hmm. in this area, in California. So, yeah. We'll, so, uh, coming back to San Francisco again. Awesome, yeah. Yes. If you let me know. And anybody from San Francisco, if you want to see them catch anything specific, maybe leave a comment and the most popular comment we'll try to go for clams maybe I don't sure. know. we'll see yeah thank you for, for coming yeah out thank you fishing. thank you for inviting us to go to the fishing of course it was a great experience so see you next time next time sure yeah.